here we are at the Neon Lights Museum in Edmonton. It's open 24 hours a day, seven days a week, but of course the best time to come is at night so you can see all of these spectacular lights. Now there's 20 different signs, neon signs, from the past that have been restored to showcase the history of Alberta. I have one favorite sign, of course, and it's just above me here. It's called Georgia Baths. Now, Georgia Baths was originally called the Edmonton Steam Baths, and it was um, created back in October of 1913. And at that time, people used to go here because it was quite luxurious. You go in and have a little steam and then a little soap scrub and then end up with a salt rub at the end. So it was a pretty special thing to do in the early 1900s. Now, of course it's gone, but it's still known as Edmonton's oldest bathhouse. Welcome to West Edmonton Mall, your entertainment destination. Do you have clients who are asking about getting away this winter, but don't want to go too far, maybe not cross the border, uh, go down south? You can send them here to West Edmonton Mall with all kinds of amazing family activities. There's Galaxy Land where we are now with fabulous rides. There's Drive, which is electric race carts on a multi-level track. And then you can also do the Flow Rider or the Zip Line. So consider West Edmonton Mall for your clients who are looking for a little weekend or week-long getaway this winter. Welcome to Rogers Place in the heart of the Ice District in downtown Edmonton. I'm standing in the Ford Hall. This is the home to the Edmonton Oilers. Go Oilers! And this is also the place where all of the major concerts happen. Anything from Elton John to Garth Brooks and everything in between. And I'm standing here in the middle of this gorgeous mosaic tile that was done by a local indigenous artist. Enjoy the view.